Hey, how's it going, guys? Yay. Happy 2024. Woo. Hopefully, you guys have a good Christmas and a uh, happy new year. Yeah, we saw how much you guys liked our video of us setting up that year tent. And we actually just recently bought this bad boy right here. I don't know if you guys have seen it. We'll bring up the box to show you guys a little bit about what it is. Let's see. Hopefully that's close All enough. right. Yeah, it's in frame. All right. This is the Mr. Heater Portable Buddy. And <laughs> apparently it's the world's best indoor safe propane heater. So, yeah, this. Okay. Uh, just to let you guys know, we already use this and we liked it so much. That's why we're making this video. Yeah. So we're just going to talk about what we like about it, maybe what we don't like about it, how to use it, because we were kind of confused for the first little bit of how to get it started and everything. So we'll just get right into it and show you guys how it works. So for starters, it's going to take these 16 ounce one pound propane tanks, or you can also buy an attachment hose to hook up to like the big white propane tanks, like everyone has on their grill. But we're just doing this one for today. So right here, is like the little uh the insert where you screw your propane in it took us a few tries to get it um just because i don't know it's probably rusty but we're gonna put this in and then show you guys how to turn on the heater i'm gonna cut this part out but i just noticed that we can like hang it on the wall. true you can hang it on the wall So now that we have this screwed in, um, uh, this is the part that we got kind of confused about was how to get it started and what would happen when we get it, got it started. So we'll kind of adjust this so you can kind of see this dial better. So you can see here that um, the dial's put all the way this direction. And there's a little, I don't know if you can see that on camera. This says pilot right here. So in order to get this to light, you have to push this down slightly and push it over to pilot and it will stop. And at this point, I don't want to hold it really against my leg. Yeah. <laughs> you click this all the way down and you can see a little flame come out. After that happens, then you can set it to, if you want it to be low heat or high heat. And you can see the little flames coming off of it. If you set it to high, it'll get a lot hotter, turn orange. Yeah. It says 5.4 hours on the one pound uh, can of propane. Um, when we were camping, I think it was really cold and I don't think it lasted quite that long, but it, it still made the tent like considerably warmer. So one thing that I think is awesome also is with that big white propane tank on the box, it tells you all you need to know, but it says with those, it can last 108 hours. So, I mean, if you kind of take how long it took for this to run out, it makes me wonder it might be a little less as well, like more like 90 hours on a big white propane tank. Um, but I just think it's awesome that they can make this last so long. Cause I mean, it's hot. If you put your hands like even this close, it hurts. In fact, at the end of the video, we'll invite a special friend over to use it and see what they think about it. And two cool features about this is one, if you tip the heater over, or it falls over in like a tent or inside, this thing will go off on its own. Watch this. Wow. That's it. And that went out fast. Like you saw how orange yeah. it was before. It's already. It's, it's gone. It's, it's I mean, warm. It, there's but... a little bit of heat, but like it's going to cool down really fast. So we'll turn that back on. And it does do that either way it tips over. And then another thing is, I don't know if this uh, happened because we were asleep in the tent, but it says that if the uh, carbon monoxide levels get too high, the heater will like recognize that and shut off. So yeah, so you don't die sleep. So it's safe indoors, in tents, wherever, in enclosed spaces, I guess. So, mm -hmm. Anything else? Anything? I, I feel like it's all pretty self-explanatory and all the questions we had were answered right on the box, like on the front side and back. Um, and this is really all you need to know about it. If you have any questions, um, you can ask us in the comments or you can look it up because 
buggy heater or whatever the Mr. Heater. Buggy. Yeah, Mr. Heater. They probably have all the answers to your questions. But okay. also, this is really good for winter camping. We really liked it. Definitely kept us warm, and it was like 20 in the 20s when we were camping. Um, and also, if if we took this camping in our yurt tent, um, it would definitely help even more because the, oh, yeah. the hot air would be going around and going up. And did, did, would you say that it actually got rid of a lot of the condensation, or did it add a lot more condensation? Um, I don't know. It didn't really like. I don't. I didn't notice any extra condensation while in the nighttime, but obviously once the sun came up, it got kind of bad. But while we were sleeping, I didn't feel anything. So. Yeah. Well, um, well, I like it. I think I feel a strange presence around here. Uh, I think it's time to invite our special guest to see how, how warm this thing is. What the? Look who it is! Check that thing out. <laughs> how would you rate this? Ten. 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 Ten.